hi guys in this video uh, we will do analysis of these two banded plates with the two different conditions like uh, one condition we will weld together this banded plate from here to here okay this all area will be welded and the one is without welding like uh, bonded and no penetration so this plate have 6 mm thickness and uh, 100 by 100 mm and the 50 mm width so let's start activate simulation and you will see the difference between bonded and non penetration contacts like welded or non welded contact okay so first we do welded plates okay we fix both these faces fixture fixed geometry this face and this face okay we keep the same contacts here these banded plates are the sheet metal okay so you will see only the one surface surface only so this is the contacts by default bonded it means this is welded from this to this this surface this surface are bonded like it's like one piece okay so we have uh, assigned our fixture top faces now we will apply some force on this edge select this face okay and normal to plane we have selected reverse direction like this and we will apply 500 uh, 200 kilowatt 200 into 9.81 newtons okay okay hit okay create mesh now run steady Okay, let's set up this. MPA advanced rendered. So this is the maximum stresses we got 132 MPA on this point. We don't need strain and check the displacement how much we got. Double click, do floating. Okay, yeah, and so the maximum deformation displacement we got 0.13 millimeter on this edge. So this is the welded scenario. Now we do with uh, without welded with just two fixed these surfaces. Copy the study. Known welding. Okay. So we keep keep the same uh, setting fixed and. The force on this edge but we need uh, to remove this global global contact delete and we will do this contact manually right click connections contact set on this uh, option box select this face and you will see node to surface Contact including shell entity face to face to process as surface to surface contact during simulation because this is a simulation part. Uh, sorry, this is a uh, sheet metal part, that's why it will contact with face to face. Now click this op, uh, box and select this face and select choose no penetration. It looks like uh, it's the two free plates with holding from this surface and this surface. Okay, now let's create mesh again. and run the study with non-penetration it takes 
a little more time compared to the bonded okay so you will see this is uh, without uh, welding two plates bended but here we got too much stress here so our material yield strength is 222 like normal material and it's pointing up here so it's mean this upside all is a fail and displacement if we got 4.6 millimeter here yeah. this is the maximum displacement let's animate okay so you can see here so it's mean it will not work how much forces we have applied 200 kilo right so if i apply here 100 kilo 100 into 9.81 then let's see if it is suitable for 100 kilo or not Yeah, now we got only 13.66 and 0.23 millimeter. So you see guys the difference between welding and non-welding analysis. Here we got with the 200 kilogram force on this edge 132 and the displacement we got only 0.13. But with the non-welding, even we applied the half of the, uh, no, actually I think we just did something wrong, 100 into 9.81, 981 force actually we required. Yeah, now we got the real result 136 megapascal maximum. The stress is on here, and the displacement maximum we have here. This is the welded, right? So, just generate report if you want to. just hit publish so it is generating the report of the analysis Okay, so you can add some data description here. So this is your all report with diagrams. The minimum 0.34 megapascal, the maximum 132. Okay guys, you can also add a factor of safety here. Right click. Define factor of safety, click next, next, okay. So here we need some setting, floating, okay. And we choose, we limit factor of safety from a table from 1 to 100. So this is standard reading from 1 to 100. Yeah. So you can define 
the minimum factor of safety we have 1.7 1.7 somewhere here all right guys so i hope you like this uh, analysis tutorial and uh, you see the difference between welded and non welded contacts with bonded and no penetration thank you guys